What is up guys? Welcome back to a family friendly vlog. No one am I kidding. This video is not family friendly whatsoever. I, at least I don't think it's gonna be. Um, so yeah. So basically just sitting sit, hanging around hanging out in my house as usual. Um nothing really going on right now. Um but yeah. So earlier <laughs> My mom thought that it was a great idea to spill a whole bunch of bleach in the kitchen. So, we had to open all the windows. Wonderful. Um, yeah. So, basically this video is, 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 uh, it's, it's about Logan Paul. If you guys can, you know. The, the reason why you guys can see that it's about Logan Paul is because you guys can see the title and everything. Bet you this will get a lot of views by just putting Logan Paul's name in. Name in. So anyway. Oh man, I almost fell out of this chair. Actually, I'm not going to do it in my chair because I'm too wound up right now to to stay, stay, um, not, not sit. Anyway, um, I bought a Logan Paul pandemic mask that it was sp supposedly zero dollars, okay? And when I went to check out, it was six dollars and ninety six cents shipping, shipping and handling. And I was thinking to myself, well, wait a second, this was supposedly free. Why is he charging six dollars and ninety six cents for something that's supposed to be free? And then I was like, oh well, it just has to come from a. California and all that and that and then and then I was researching what you charge shipping and handling by and you charge that by how much the thing weighs okay and a cloth mask is not gonna even gonna weigh a pound it's not even gonna weigh a pound so okay. The most that you'd have to ch charge is about 50 cents. So, if you take 30,000 people who bought all of them and they were already all sold out, okay, and I'm one of the people who bought them, tell me why, tell me why you, you made, you made what, um... Hundred and eighty thousand dollars off of people who are just trying to buy a pandemic mask because they want to stay safe if they ever have to go out, God forbid they have to go out. So you made like a hundred and eighty thousand dollars off of people uh because they just wanted to buy a mask that you said that it was free. If it was free and the shipping and handling didn't cost anything, and you made sure of that, it wouldn't cost anything, okay? And everyone would be getting off scot-free. It's been 13 days since I ordered it, okay? And on the website, it says it would take 7 to 10 business days. It has been 13 days. The mail has come and gone every day except for Sunday, okay? Now, there were two Sundays since I bought it, okay? If you take those two Sundays off, it's 11 days. So it's been 11 days. It's been... A little bit over 10 business days since it has gotten here, okay? Alright? Where is the mask? Where is it? I see everyone else getting them. Where is it? The whole reason why I think this is all a scam is just because everyone is so desperate to make a, a couple bucks, a couple dollars in their, in quarantine. I'm, I'm make, I'm making paintings. Okay, so you get a couple of dollars, and I have offers on the paintings, just just for, um, not not even like fifteen dollars. Like my lowest offer was eight dollars. Okay, all right, and uh, yeah, so there's still one. There's still no mask. Two, it shouldn't cost six dollars, almost seven dollars. It should cost. It should. It should not cost seven dollars for shipping and handling when it doesn't even weigh a pound. Okay. And three, you're just trying to make a quick buck. And, and you made $180,000, $180,000 off of people who are just desperate and don't have a mask. I, I'm, 
always kind of flip-flopping on Logan Paul's content, whether I think it's worthy of watching or not, okay? All right, yes, he was trying to do something for his community. Did it, did it go out? Did it come across, you know, to people the right way? No, no, it did not. Because he didn't make the shipping and handling free and everything, and that's the whole point of this video. But <sighs> making the shipping and handling free or not, it shouldn't take 11 days for something to get here when it said it was going to take 7 to 10 business days. If it says it's going to take 7 to 10 business days, it should not take 11. This is what I'm saying, folks. Any other time that I've ordered something off of Logan Paul's website, whether it be a shirt or something like that, or a sticker, it always came less. It always came quicker quicker than that and I realize there's not a lot of people in the factory working okay but everyone else is getting their stuff everyone else in the in the neighborhoods getting their packages maybe it got lost in the UPS packages but maybe you should have a better organization to figure all that out this is what I'm saying folks now I don't care if you um, like my opinion or not this is just my opinion on it so thank you guys for watching and if you guys like it subscribe but if you guys don't like it, unsubscribe and you can go screw off somewhere. I, I couldn't care. So yeah, this has been my video. Goodbye.